Hamilton County Commissioners voted three zip to approve the resolution just a few hours ago. And as nine on your sides, Palisaro tells us it's been a long time coming, huh, Paula? Absolutely. In fact, it's been mountains of hard work and for it all to come to fruition, Mel Hilltop, which is the company right here behind me, will have to eventually relocate. So the agreement says that the county will actually buy half of the Hilltop space here behind me, which will be used for tailgating for the Bengals, game day parking. The big question last week was, you know, if the Bengals are giving up parking lot space for the music venue, where will they get parking? So the space here is your answer. It accounts to about 17 acres at a price tag of $29.75 million for the land and relocation costs. It is also estimated that more than 2,500 20, 20, construction jobs and more than 3,000 permanent jobs will be created and that this will bring in more than $400 million in development. Number at $29,750,000 is uh, under the budget uh, when the, when the uh, Bengals said we're willing to allocate $30 million to this endeavor. It's really a game changer for the for the business at the banks because the the music venue will not only bring a lot of people during the downtime and also the frequency of events. We're talking about 150 events a year. Now in release statements, Hilltop, which has moved its plant operations in the past, said it is, quote, willing to re relocate again so that our riverfront can continue its incredible transformation. As to where it's relocating, that's still not clear. The Bengals also released a statement saying in part that the solution is an innovative one and adds meaningful green space to the riverfront. Now, President Denise Driehaus did say that she hopes the music venue will be done by fall of 2020, which is just one year away. It's pretty remarkable. And they also tell us that it will seat 4,500 people inside and about 8,500 people on the outside on the green space of the venue. Now, we're live at the banks. I'm Paolo Lucero, not on your side.